My name is Manko Madu. I'm Director of Programs at Afi Labs. We are here at the IATF 2021 implementing the Youth Hack, which is basically a hackathon that is organized for the youth at the Youth Pavilion. Uh, the aim of this is to bring together the brilliant young you know, Africans to one place and have them just ideate and come up with solutions. The idea is to generate some African solutions to African problems. I've seen them, they form teams, you know, they've been racking their brains. I also saw them do their, their test pitches earlier on. And I was so inspired to see the entrepreneurs coming together, coming up with an idea, figuring out what is the challenge, who's it for, who's their target, and actually coming up with a solution in the space of just a few hours. So I'm really looking forward to tomorrow. I'm looking forward to the pitching. In whatever you are facing, there's thousands of people who are propelling you to move forward and succeed. And also, uh, we've been partnering with uh, Brazil Bank on this specific uh, initiative. Uh, Bavia actually has uh, women and young entrepreneurs at the core of its uh, strategy. How do we make sure that our stories translate to What is important about your brand is that it's an African brand. It is important that we develop propositions uh, at the bottom of the curve. So the bank believes that any change happens with intent. So last week, the youth in this room have been part of um, several programs, uh, all geared around supporting them to innovate for Africa's most pressing issues. We've had Africa Next Champions pitching competition, and we've had the youth hack that has gone on for the last few days. This is group number 10 presenting to you our solution as follows. The problem statement. There's a clear lack of African youth SME access to skills, work tools to develop their business. What's our solution? Our solution is to come up with a multi-sided online and offline virtual platform that provides access to business development tools designed to capacitate and develop SMEs. So yeah, we are together. However, trade and services remains the biggest trade barrier for unlocking cross-border trade on the continent. I think I just had two small questions. The first one is uh, really about the functionality of the platform. We decided to come up with eMarket Africa, which is a platform that is developed to assist the AFCFTA to implement the trade and services protocol. We are going to look at how we can solve water management crisis that affects agricultural productivity. So according to the Food and Agricultural Organization... How sustainable is that project? That's one. And the second aspect is about the technology we're using. So according to the Food and Agricultural Organization, in 2050 uh, there's going to be the population of Africans being 2.5 million. Currently that will be the double of what our population is now. Uh, interesting presentation. Africa does not have a local currency and therefore susceptible to high and unregulated costs of remittance transactions. We have a little bit more about how you intend to generate adoption of your technology. Our solution to develop a centralized banking system in Africa with an application that integrates existing financial technologies using a common virtual currency throughout the continent, which will be regulated by regional and, cont and continental financial bodies. Who is excited? We are enthusiastic in, in, in driving um, the development of our continent. And the innovation that you bring to this, that it actually finds expression and becomes a reality. Today I want to urge all you young people, in your space. Uh, not anyone keep it up. Uh, not any material loss. Um, make you despondent, but the power of the mind, the power of inspiration can take you uh, through every hurdle that is placed in your way. Does it give you energy? <laughs> That's what I want. Energy is very important. When you have the energy, you have the drive. We are together, start alone. 
both of the partnership. And this is just to encourage the young uh, innovators to begin to push their ideas forward and begin to collaborate and network to ensure that they are solving you know the challenges that, are, that is facing the continent so we're very excited about that but we're excited about the ideas we're already seeing the solutions we're already seeing most of them again very innovative and geared towards tech solutions so that makes us very excited uh, and happy to be here so yeah um, thank you